Hey Jimmy, in 30 minutes or so, I would like us to go to the grocery store together. Can you please wrap up your game by then? Okay mom. Because you are playing a game, I'm unsure if you heard me. Can you please tell me what you heard me ask? Yeah. That you are taking me to buy a video game in 30 minutes. Thank you for telling me what you heard. I'm glad you heard that I want us to leave in 30 minutes. Yep. What I want to be more clear about is where we are going. We are going to the grocery store. Okay. We are going to the grocery store in 30 minutes. Yep. See you soon. Hey Jimmy, it has been 30 minutes. Are you ready to go to the grocery store now? No. I want to stay home and keep playing Scourge of the Overprotective Adults. You are having a lot of fun with that game and would love to play it all day. Yes. I love this new mind control interface. All I have to do is focus my thoughts and my Xbox 9000 knows that I want my character on the screen to run away from the over-controlling adult monsters. Amazing. And listen to the funny things they say, Mom. I'm humiliating you for your own good, boy. You'll thank me later. Haha. <laughs> that is funny. Oh, and listen to this one. That was a rude thing to say, boy. I'm gonna take away your toys and beat you with my fist, so to learn you better how to talk nice to people. Wow, that sounds like my dad. I can see why you enjoy this game, Jimmy. It would be so fun if we could play games all the time. Totally. That's what I want. Me too. And I wish food would magically show up in our empty refrigerator. Pizzas. Cookies. Ice cream. I also wish I could feel safe leaving you at home by yourself while I go shopping. That way you could stay home and play all you want. Yeah. Please leave me at home, Mom. You would love for me to go by myself so that you can stay here and play? Yes. Do you remember when you burned our last house down so now we have that agreement about you staying home alone? Yes. So right now you want to play and I want to go get food so that we have enough to eat. Can't we just get food tomorrow? But what if there is a zombie apocalypse tomorrow? Very funny, Mom. You are not hungry right now and right now playing is more fun? Yes. We can get food later. It is easy for you to see why play is a fun thing to do right now and it is hard to see why it is important to go get food when you are not hungry right now? Yeah. Do you remember how hungry you were before dinner last night? Nice try, Mom. I just want to keep playing. I know, Jemmy. So leave me alone so I can do that. Jemmy. I hear your need for play and need for not being told what to do. I also want you to recognize my needs for nurturing, fairness, respect, and efficiency. It is very important to me that we go to the grocery store right now. 30 minutes ago we made an agreement that we would go. We build trust when we stick to our agreements. I am sad that we are interrupting your need for play. Do you want to turn off the game or shall I do it? You don't care about my needs. You feel angry and hopeless when your needs are not met. Yes. Jemmy. I want you to know that I do care about your needs. You have needs for play and for nourishment from food. Nourishment from food is more important than play because if we don't eat, we die and dead boys can't play games. I'll turn the game off, mom. Thank you so much, Jimmy, for talking this through with me. I feel sad when I have resorted to pushing you to see other needs because I want you to be able to make your own decisions. I know how frustrating it can be when I tell you what to do. Yeah. It is. I want to make my own decisions. I... What? I guess you have lived longer and stuff so you know more about needs. Yes. Oh sweetie it feels so good to hear you say that. Can I finish this level before we go? Can the game be paused where it is right now? Yes. Then please pause it and we will go now. Okay. Thanks, Jemmy. Hey mom. What? I really love you. 